he would die. I haven't played that in a while. Let's go here. Alright folks, got a couple of packages today. Uh, we got a pretty thick envelope and some Royal Mail coming from the UK. <clears throat> Let's get into this one. <clears throat> and this is coming from the same guy that sent me the three Game Boys. So I got back with him and he said that they didn't work. He wanted me to get them into working status and replace the screens on them wash the shells, get them cleaned up for them. So uh, I already took care of that. And uh, he told me that he sent me something else and this is just for me to keep. So I'm not sure what we got here. <clears throat> Let's see. Okay. What's this? Oh, very cool, dude, thank you. Say what? Okay, <laughs> that's weird. All right, so um, there's a, a Batman wallet, brand new Batman wallet. And uh, it's made out of like a canvas material. And there's $10.25 <laughs> inside the billfold. Uh, so pretty awesome there. Um, I think that was covering some shipping, some shipping uh, charges. But uh, we got a little silica pack, brand new Batman wallet. That is awesome. Thank you, dude. I really, really appreciate that, um, Clinton. I really appreciate that, Clinton. Thank you so much. All right, and then we got some mail from the UK. So let's dive on in. And I think I know what this is. I ordered a game from a company and it never got shipped out. Yep, that's what this is. Okay, so this is Demon's Age. And this is only um, in physical form from uh, in the PAL region. And it got it recently got taken off the PlayStation Network. So if you want to play it now, the only way to to do so is to get the physical version. And there's a, a company called 365 Games. They were having a sale on them, and I think it was like 10 bucks. Um, 10 bucks shipped. I think it came out of like 10 or $12 shipped. Brand new copy. Um, but you could only get a physical form, like I said, in the PAL region, and it's no longer available on the PlayStation Network. So I went ahead and jumped on that. Um, I ordered this game a couple of months ago, as a matter of fact. And they sent out a, an email stating that it had been shipped. I waited weeks and weeks and weeks and it never arrived. So I got back in touch with them and they shipped it uh, international priority. So they made sure that it got here quick. So there you have it, folks. Demon's Age. And a Batman wallet with some money. On to the next. The game. I sent you the pictures of last night. Okay. There's more than I think she's putting in pictures. All right. Let's That's see. a three big adapter. Okay. It looks about like all of them. It might be. Yeah. There's where I'm still not going. See the paddle. There's yeah, the, the three glasses. glasses. There's the cable for it. Ten and four. That's the. Uh, that's the I think that goes to this.
that you want. Yep. Yeah, see, mine's, mine's broken right here on the corner. Yeah. And the power switch will still work. But, uh, yeah, it got busted up. Yeah, that looks in pretty good condition right there. Genesis. Yeah. Alright. That one's seen better days, hasn't it? Yeah, I'll say that one goes. Cool. These things must be hard to find. For the Genesis? Yeah. They're hard to find with their original clamshell. Uh, yeah. Um usually when I find Genesis games they're like this. Yeah. But to find them with that clamshell case that they came in. It's pretty hard to find sometimes. That's the original box and the uh, PS2 in here. Yeah. Cool. Oh, there it is. Yep. Yeah. There's that. There's the main. Okay. Cool. Hookups. Nice. Oh. Yeah. All right, cool. That's the PlayStation. The PlayStation uh, two, games, games, two games. One and two games. The controllers. I feel about I had some extra hookups. I threw them in there in case you had something you might need them to go. Okay. Through. Yeah. But I don't need them. Cool. Give you all the stuff. Stuff. None of them was messed up, they just had to write on the cases. Transfer pack. There's a few of these I needed for my collection, for sure. Hey, that's one of them right there. Scooby Doo. Scooby Doo. Huh. Got a deal in 64 here. Yeah. Play the piss out of this. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> and then nice. there's the, what was that thing? Uh, for the master the memory card deal where did it, where'd it go oh it's up here oh, okay yeah that's good Oh, in the system. Okay. I yeah, yeah. I couldn't find the. I couldn't find the end, so. Oh, cool. All right. Yeah, I didn't see that system in, uh, in yeah, any of the pictures. Yeah. Remember, I told you I couldn't find the cords. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've ever seen it. I remember when I was a kid. I cut it and broke it and I worked yeah. it. <laughs> that was always a hard game. 
Dr. Jekyll. Mr. Hyde. Up with a duck, that duck game. Oh, yeah. Ski or die. I haven't played that in a while. Street Brawlers. I'm gonna play them by heart. You remember, remember the mermaid with the shark? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and much in uh, Atari games, yeah. the PlayStation. Yeah, last one she did. So I had all the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe a couple times. Minutes, 30 minutes <laughs> total. That was it. Yeah. Seems to be the way kids do things. But now that PlayStation 4? Oh, Lord. They stay on that. Totally different story, yeah. huh? Yeah. That'd be fine. Huh? I still have to find a thing okay. to stuck the car game in there. Okay. And this one here, you can also stick the yeah. games in there. Yeah. Now, this thing here, I think, has got uh, some games built into it. Yeah, don't but it? I think it's got like 300, 400 games built into it. Oh, nice. Uh, there's the power, yeah. both controllers. All you got to do is get you uh, some AV cables. Yeah, All right, cool. Yeah. Sensor bar, power, nunchucks, controllers. All right. Rechargeable. Nice. Nice. This is this. I don't know if there's a game in there or not. No, there's not. Not that. It came off. And there was one PlayStation 3 game in there. Yeah. Cool. I know that one holds me. I don't think I got that one. I don't think I got that one. Or this one. And I bought this thing, and guess what? They've never played with it. <laughs> how much I give for this? Oh, wait, this is a big sports right there. Yeah. $100? $100 for just staying in the whole game and everything. There you go. They've never played it. Anything else? That's it. That's all of it? Yes. All right, so what we, it's 450 Yes, sir. All right. Catch your money, make sure it's all there. I figured that was a deal for you. Oh yeah, it works out great for me. Yes, All right, man. I appreciate yes, it. Maybe yes, you make sir. some money on it. Oh yeah, I make, make a little, make a little bit. bit on it. Yeah. I make a little bit on it, but I'll get to keep some cool stuff too. Yeah. That I don't have.
Okay, folks, it's about 9.30 at night. I just took my dog out and decided I'd check the mail and got another package. This one is coming from GameStop. If it's what I think it is, this is the only place I have seen uh, this game for sale other than like eBay. But, went ahead and picked up. Oh, nice. Okay. So GameStop threw in a Cyberpunk 2077 like card. Pre-order today and get up to $10 cash back. I guess it's just a promotional card. But... We got Daymare, the Black Edition. This is a survival horror game. And I have not seen this through any other retailer other than GameStop. So, not sure if it's exclusive or not. But, survival horror game, I'm in. Alright folks, on to the next. Okay, so I figured we'd just go over that lot. I don't know if you were able to see everything. Uh, it was about 10 minutes long that I was there with the guy. But picked up quite a few systems. We got two Sega Genesis Model 2s. We got a standard uh, PlayStation 1. No AV uh, ports on the back. We've got an N64. No expansion pack. Uh, a Wii with uh missing a little flap door right there no big deal though a ps1 classic i did not buy one of these so kind of happy to get one of these in this lot um now that i've got it i uh, plan on keeping it so that's fantastic and we got a silver ps2 slim in the box the box is a little beat up but still the first one that I have come across in the box. Um, I'm not sure if the matching uh, silver PS2 controller is in there. I think it's a black one. I haven't opened it up since since I got everything here. Um, I guess we can go ahead and do that. Let's see. We got the system. And yeah. Standard PS2 controller with bad joysticks. I can find a uh, a silver controller to match that, and then we'll have one complete in the box. And then we've got the Master System, and that's in much better condition than mine. Mine's all broken right here. And then we got the Atari 2600. So that's all the systems, and then the accessories and games, and... Try to keep my shadow out of it. <clears throat> we'll start over here. Uh, loose PS1. We got Tomb Raider 3. Uh, test Drive Off-Road. Need for Speed. Hot Pursuit 2 on PS2. Wii Sports. That'll sell quick. Shootout 97. Tomb Raider. NFL Game Day 2000. Rushdown. Cabela's Ultimate Deer Hunt. ATV Quad Power Racing. Motocross Mania. Just needs a uh, a lid for that case. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4. This is not MLB The Show 15. This is actually Murdered uh, Soul Suspect on the PS3. We got Big League Sports. Most of these Wii games are complete. Um, Just Dance 4. My Sims. Carnival Games. Water Sports. We Play. Dance Dance Revolution Hottest Party, Just Dance, Just Dance 2, Carnival Games Mini Golf, Donkey Kong Country Returns, Wii Sports Resort, and Super Mario Galaxy. I've got to get some of these quick sellers listed today. So we'll make a lot of these Just Dance games, and probably the Carnival Games. There's another Just Dance, so we'll make a lot out of that. These four right here will sell quickly. We'll make a lot out of the Carnival games. We'll sell My Sims. And then I think Water Sports and Big League Sports are two that I need. And then we'll list We Play and get it sold too. All right. <clears throat> the PS2 games. We got Kung Fu Panda. 
Transformers the Game, Ford Racing 2, Iron Man, The Getaway Black Monday. I don't think I have that one. Grand Theft Auto Vice City, Troll Q, uh, Need for Speed Most Wanted, High Heat Major League Baseball 2004, Madden 2002, Rapala Pro Fission, Pimp My Ride, MLB 09 The Show, Pac-Man World Rally, which I've never seen this one before. It must be maybe a little uncommon out of the Pac-Man games. I always see the Pac-Man World games, but I've never seen World Rally, so I'll be adding that one to the collection. Pac-Man World 3, Pac-Man World 2, Pac-Man World 2, Cars Made Her National, and SmackDown vs. Raw 2008. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy out of the PS2 games. Couple of good uh, Wii games. Definitely nothing crazy out of the PS1 games. And then these last two boxes. I'll go ahead and show this right here. This is uh, an official Nintendo 64 travel bag I will take the straps off I will throw this in the wash on delicate so cycle and it'll clean up nice these bags you can always throw them in the washing machine and clean them up and they come out really nice if as long as you like wash them on gentle all right this box is full of games so we'll just start we got a whole bunch of Atari games Baseball, Star Raiders, E.T., Circus Atari, Space Invaders, Night Driver, and Air Sea Battle. And we got a few more here. We got Defender. Um, here's an Intellivision game, Dungeons and Dragons, Treasure of Tarman. That's worth a little bit of something, so I'll sell that separately. A couple of uh, loose games here. We got Six Pack on the Genesis and... Thunderblade for the Master System. We've got some more 2600 games here. Asteroids, Pac-Man, Combat, and Carnival. I've got a uh, transfer pack here. And a uh, condom, a Wii, Wiimote condom. We've got some N64 games. we got uh, Ridge, Racer, Ridge Racer 64, uh, MRC, Star Wars uh, Rogue Squadron. Star Wars Shadows of the Empire, Cruising USA, uh, Olympic Hockey 98, Blast Core, and Scooby Doo Classic Creep Capers. This is the gray cart variant. Uh, this game was originally released in a black cart, and uh, this is the re release in the gray cart. So, this is one of the 13 variants I needed. I'm definitely keeping that. All right. Then we've got the 3D adapter for the 3D glasses for the Sega Master System. Uh, F-16 Fighting Falcon. This is a Sega card game and it was not in the box. So, got an empty case there. And then we've got Shinobi. And that's complete. Great Golf, the Mega Cartridge. Uh, complete. Afterburner complete. Let's see. Missile Defense 3D complete. Zaxxon 3D complete. Action Fighter. Let's see. Uh, might be missing the manual. That was just the game catalog. Then we got Hang On and Safari Hunt. Missing the manual. Zillion, and that's complete. Astro Warrior, complete. Space Harrier, complete. And Marksman Shooting and Trap Shooting. Um, let's see, and that's complete as well. So most of those Master System games are complete. Then we got some Nintendo games, NES games. We got Hoops. Let's see. I'll... Let's see. We got hoops. Uh, Crash in the Boys Street Challengers. One you don't see every day. It's about a thirty dollar, thirty thirty five dollar game. Uh, it does have some marker on it, which should clean up. But definitely one I don't have for collection. I don't even think I have hoops. 
So a lot of these NES games are going in the collection. Platoon. I don't have that one. Super Mario 2. And Silent Service. And let's see. Hook. That's another one I don't have. Demon Sword I don't have. Dr. Jekyll Mr. Hyde I don't have. Dick Tracy. I think I've got. But let's just say I don't have it. I think I may have sold it. Uh, Ninja Turtles 2 arcade game. Mario uh, Duck Hunt World Class Track Meet and Ski or Die. I don't think I've got that one either. And then let's see. We got Mario Duck Hunt, DuckTales, Ghostbusters 2, Rad Racer 2, Bad Street Brawler. That's one I don't think I have. Friday the 13th and Mario 3. As well as Steel Cage, which I may or may not have. The Little Mermaid, I don't have. That's a fantastic Capcom game. And Jurassic Park, that's about another $15 to $20 game on the Nintendo. That's another one I don't have. So there's all the games out of that box. And then the other uh, games. A lot of the N64 games I have already sold because, you know, they're like Super Mario, Donkey Kong, Mario Kart. They're like high dollar really good selling games right now and so um i've got most of them <clears throat> um a lot of them already sold so <clears throat> let's see we got uh mortal kombat sub-zero mythologies vigilante 8 second offense the collector's edition zelda uh majora's mask with the lenticular cover hologram cover Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 3, this game has shot up so much in price. It's like a $60 game now. Polaris Snowcross. Beetle Adventure Racing. 1080. Mario Party 2. Smash Bros. Banjo Kazooie and Mario Kart 64. Um, these are all listed. And so those are are for sale and then the top three games out of the entire lot uh joe and mac this actually showed up really busted um the the shell was all busted up i opened it up and super glued it put some gorilla glue on it and got the uh the case kind of back together and i'm okay with this until i find another copy this copy works just fine i was playing it you know just last night then we got Splatterhouse 2 in pretty good condition. Does have a little nick right there on the on the label. And then we got Bucky O'Hare. It's about a, about a hundred and fifty to two hundred dollar game. Uh, price is going up on it. It did have a big number fourteen right here. I tried, so I didn't want to you know like scrub too hard and discolor the cartridge. And uh, we've got a little bit of label damage here. But I should be able to fix that with a glue stick. And then that'll be a, a nice little copy of Bucky O'Hare in my collection. And then, last but not least, we've got this whole box here full of accessories. So here are the 3D glasses for the Master System. We want to clean those up and test them. And then we've got the uh, Sega Genesis AT game system here. It's got some built-in games. You can also play cartridges on it with the controllers. And then we got the Sega Master System Light Phaser Gun. Um, some Wiimotes. We got some PS1 controllers. The Zapper. Some Sega Genesis controllers. A whole bunch of um, uh, Nintendo NES controllers. And like the power cords and everything. I added everything, all of this up on price charting, and the entire lot came out to just over $2,500. That's including the prices of each controller and the, the zapper guns and the phaser and the 3D glasses and all the games and, and everything in the condition that it was in. I paid $450 for everything, and I'll make all of that money back just selling the good N64 games alone. Um, and I'll be in profit. So this was a fantastic haul. Fantastic haul. Um, I'm really stoked about this N64 bag. I'm happy to add that to the collection. Definitely happy to add some of these heavy hitter titles into the collection. 
such as Splatterhouse 2 and Bucky O'Hare. And uh, definitely, I got like an, an automatic little Sega Master System collection right there. So I think I only have three Master System games. That's a good chunk of uh, games for to add into the collection. But there you have it, folks. On to the next.